Dear Diary, today all of me and my friends, we is getting ready to go to the cabin. And I'm kind of excited and kind of happy because we're going to be seeing some drama. And I'm also happy because me and Grace have worked out our problems at Barbie's party. Now, sincerely, Claudine. Frankie, look at all the stuff that I have packed up in my suitcase so far. What did you pack up? I don't know. I got to go home first. That's why I'm waiting for you. Grace, do you feel like coming with me to my house? She kiss and try. We could go there, Claudine. We could leave them two here alone. Yeah. So first, let me pack up myself, then we could drive over to your house. All right. Um. Okay, Grace. Me and Frankie about to go. Yeah, we're about to go. Thanks for letting me use your laptop to um, print out my report. Oh, wait, hold up, because they're asking me questions. All right. Oh. You're welcome. All right. We'll leave you two here alone. Okay. Okay, come on, Claudia. Let's go. All right. You got your seatbelt on? Yeah. All right, got the suitcase ready. And Okay, let's go. <laughs> so you dancing with me now, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so we gotta talk about something. Boy, come on, we was just in a dancing romantic mood and stuff. You wanna ruin it with drama? Yes, I do. Now sit down on the couch. Ugh, ow. So, um, your sister, she still don't like me. Me and you still didn't get to, you know, talk about that. So, when you tell her that me and you still, like, going out, like, what is she going to think? Um, well, my sister's in the CCCs, but, like, I think I could probably talk to her when, when we go home or something. Really? Mm-hmm. She takes things kind of well when it's coming from her family, but, you know, I'll try. I'm just scared. Why are you scared? Because what if we can't be together anymore? Because she's going to try to ruin our relationship. You two got to try to build a friendship. I uh, know. Just so scared. Uh -huh, I'm so bored. Why am I grounded? Gosh, I, I never even do anything. I'm a tour to come over. I miss her. Hey, dude, I'm ready to go to the cabin. Look at what I'm wearing. Like, seriously, I'm looking hot right now. Those girls are going to be all over me. Ha, ha, ha. Brag all you want to. I can't go to the cabin with you guys. Why can't you go to the cabin? Because I got an F on one of my texts. So, you know. Hmm. I can talk to your mom for you. Tell her that this trick could be educational. Really, dude, that's not going to work. Oh, gosh. Why you always got to be so complicated? Your room is really cool. Since you moved here, you got, ooh, she's kind of hot. I know that's why I have her poster up there. Uh, put on some shoes. Ooh, your feet freak. I mean, like, seriously, dude. You got to try putting something on there. Like, I think I almost fainted. Then don't smell my feet, then. See, that's exactly what he gets. Ugh. Okay, um. Ooh, you got to let me borrow those shoes, bro. Those things are so cool. Oh, I thought my feet stunk, though. You want to play that game now? Mm-hmm. Where's your shirt? Put on a shirt. <laughs> it's right there. Oh, you have another poster with your name on it. Oh, uh, duh. Oh, uh, duh. Oh, uh, duh. Don't ask me. I'll go talk to your mom for you so that you can go to the cabin. You could try, but it's not going to work. Ten minutes later. Dude, it 
work. It worked. What do you mean it worked? My mom would never even say anything like that. It worked, dude. Let me tell you. I told her that it was going to be educational and stuff like that. And you get to um, do all types of practicing with different activities such as surfing, stuff like that. But we can't surf there. It's a cabin. Like, the water's frozen. Duh. Come on, dude. Just go with the flow. Pack up yourself. We're about to get ready. Dude, this is awesome, dude. Uh. Oh, dude. Look at, look at this hat that I got. It's so cool, right? Yeah, it is. Ken! Yes, Mom. You got more company over. Let him in. Oh gosh. Kenny. Hey. <gasps> Torlai, babe. Hi. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh my god, you guys do this all the time and then you always get me jealous and I wish that I had a girlfriend and all that other stuff. Da -da -da -da. Don't worry, dude. You'll find love someday. Oh, put on a shirt. Gosh. Come on, we gotta get ready to go anyway. What's his deal? He wish he had a girlfriend. Ryan always been like that. It's just that he's always being like a player, so no girls really want him that much. But I feel he might find love someday. But right now, he's just the type to get jealous. Then we should help him out someday so that he could find love and then be like us. Sure. Come on, let's get out of here. Oh my God, Frankie, I've never been to your house before. This is real cute, even though it's kind of little. But like, it's something, I guess. Yeah, do you like my vanity? It costs a lot of money. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at this fur coat. You gotta let me borrow that coat sometime, girl. I'm telling you, because I'm a fashionista. <laughs> um, you're not really that funny, Claudine. I'm sorry. Forget you. Uh, we gotta hurry up and get ready to go to the cabin. Everybody's over there. I read um, everyone's um, update on teens.com. And everyone's talking about how cool it is there and stuff like that. So you need to hurry up. Okay, hold on. I still gotta pack up my suitcase. It's packed up already. You're just trying to worry about makeup. Fine. I'm just going to put on my coat, then we're going to go. All right. Get the car warmed up. All right. Oh, she really left the suitcases here. Uh, I get my life! Huh. Let's go. Oh my gosh, this cabin is so cool. I mean, like, seriously, it really is. Look at that fireplace. <laughs> We're going to be keeping warm. Look at the bookshelf. Ooh, look at the nightstand. Ooh, look at this lip over here, y'all. This is so cute. I swear. Ah, oh, I'll land on you, babe. Uh -huh. Ooh, look at the fridge. Is there any snacks in there? The kitchen looks awesome. Everyone, we're here. <laughs> uh, excuse me? Uh, nothing. Uh, that's what I thought. Oh, Kenny, we could sleep here because there's no beds in here. I'm sorry, gosh. Jackie Laura, move. Um, I'm not going to move right now. I, I want to stay here. <laughs> I'm going to stay here right now. You can't tell me anything. I swear, this girl is so crazy. Hey, Denise. How sweet, pay. Dracula, Laura, can you please just go? No. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna go skydiving. <laughs> Oops. My bad, like I care. She should have been carrying her stuff. Daddy. Hey, what's up, guys? Frankie here. <laughs> really, no one wants to answer me? Why well, do you care? Daddy. Oh, hi, Barbie. Hey, Frankie. You can speak? Oh, my God. She needs to go take her bipolar medicine. 
I left it home. Oh, you look real pretty. Ah! Freaking out of here. Idiots. What the heck did she just do? I don't know. She just fell on the floor. Claudine Wolf in the building. Cla Cla Claudine in the building. <laughs> A corny on. And guess what? I had on did my report on how Martin Luther King had freed the slaves. What the heck? Oh, uh, 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 uh. did you hear? Like, did you hear? What? Martin Luther King did not like free the slaves. It was Abraham Lochner. What? It was Abraham Lochner. Abraham Lincoln did not free the slaves. It was Martin Luther King. It was Abraham Lochner. Did you hear? Did you hear? How Martin Luther King kept on saying, um, oh, how, how, it's like, free at last, free at last, free at last. Oh, God, God. Are you racist? Like, are you racist? Ow, are you racist? I am not racist. I am not a racist woman, okay? I'm not. <laughs> if I'm like, nah, and my other cop says otherwise, and don't even make me mention Barack Obama. So ghetto. What? Get out, girl. Get out, girl. Enough for this. I'm going to the pool. I mean, to the hot tub. <sighs> hey guys, what's up? Oh, why is what? What the heck happened to Frankie? Um, I'm ready to go into the hot tub. Look at how I'm dressed. I'm so ready for this trip. 